everyone and welcome back to my channel so in this video i'm going to be showing you guys a diy that can help you with hair growth if you are interested in this video then please stay tuned so the ingredients that you're going to need for this diy is going to be one cup of calendula flowers and two cups of hot water some of the benefits of calendula flowers is that it is used to hydrate dry scalp, remove dandruff, and improve the condition of the scalp. With its rejuvenating properties, it helps the hair follicles grow abundantly, allowing for thicker hair, and the antioxidants help protect the hair and scalp against cell damaging free radicals. So now I'm just going to place the flowers into a bowl and then I'm just going to pour hot water over the flowers. Also these flowers help to stop and reverse hair loss because it helps to increase collagen production which helps to keep your hair follicles healthy and each strand of hair thick so that way it doesn't break off. So now I'm just going to make sure that all the flowers are submerged into the water and I'm going to let it sit for about 15 minutes. Also, you can let it sit until the water is completely cool. So after about 15 minutes, this is what it looks like and I'm just going to strain it and then place the rinse into a spray bottle for easier application. Now when it comes to storage, you want to place it into the refrigerator when not in use and it should last about two to four weeks and if you want it to last longer, you can place it into the freezer and it should last about three to six months. Also when it comes to this hair rinse, it's also a tea as well so if you want to you can drink this as well you could drink this daily and it also will provide the same benefits um, as using it as a tea rinse or you can do both you can use that as a tea rinse and you could also drink it as a tea So when using this as a hair rinse, you want to apply this all over your hair and scalp after you shampooed your hair because you want to make sure that your scalp is clean. Once you've sprayed it all over your hair and scalp, you're just going to leave it on your hair for about 30 minutes and then you're going to rinse it out and then you're going to follow up with your favorite deep conditioner. So you can do this method whenever it's your wash day. So whether you wash your hair once a week or every two weeks, so it'll just be up to you. So that's how often you should use the rinse whenever it's your wash day. Also, you can use this spray as a leave-in. If you want to use it as a leave-in, um, you can use it two to three times a week. All you have to do is just apply it on your scalp and also all over your hair from root to ends and then make sure you follow up with your favorite hair oil or hair butter or cream so that way you can seal in the moisture. So 
Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.